So, Joshua, is Max bullying you? Well, now wait a minute. I'm not a bully. You know why, Mr. Cartwright? You're having a hard time fooling me. Because she, too, was a typical bully. Hey, babe. Long time no see. Babe. I just saw you yesterday. We did the same ridiculous slow motion walk down the hallway that you do every day. Well, there goes your date. Like every bully, she is. <laughs> My hair! If it makes you feel any better, it wasn't that cute in the first place. <laughs> Hey jerk, if you don't move that old rusty tin can, I'm gonna squash it like a pop can and throw it in the recycle bin. Tony, why must I come home every day to a sink full of dishes? This house is a mess. And a clean kitchen isn't gonna change that. Look, what I do is none of your business. Just do what I ask. Actually, it is my business. And I've reported you to the store owner. Tony. Uh, yes, Mr. Richard? Well, you do not have to see me this summer. Why, are you going to get them all out this summer? No, it's going to summer school. But why? Is that your question? No, I demand an answer. But the bullshit finally lands her in the principal's office. And you may never return to this school ever again. What do they do to you? They transfer me to another school. That doesn't sound that bad. Well, it wasn't just any old school. Nor were these just any old students. Excuse me? You are definitely no Barbie.com advertisement. Princess Fiona. It's <laughs> whatever I say. Excuse me. Did I utter? <laughs> In case we didn't make ourselves clear, we run this. Welcome to our world. <laughs> 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 <la